Hi guys, uh, welcome back to another episode on the Rajiv Nair podcast. This is a series about things that you can learn from people around you or the ones who are still on their path to attain perfection. So today I'm going to talk about my first love and probably my favorite love that is cricket. And uh, you might be knowing why I'm doing this now because we have this euphoria of IPL the Indian Premier League going on right now and this is the probably the right time to gain more audience maybe and get them to listen to whatever bullshit that I say online so the new IPL season that is the IPL 2021 season is on the way and it has been an exciting one week and it doesn't feel like the last match has been played 6 months before this so it's really interesting and we are waiting for more matches and more excitement throughout the tournament tournament so today i have with me my friend jashwant kankala a wonderful follower keen enthusiast of the game and is known as uh, asha bogle of wizag among us circles so <laughs> we wanted to try and take our analysis of the games into next level by putting out our perspectives which we do on a daily basis but mostly on our whatsapp chats during the matches and sometimes after the matches so we wanted to try and uh, make it more interesting and somewhat understandable to all the others around us so hi hi jashwant how are you yeah i'm good nair how are you doing yeah man so let's start um, so what are your thoughts about the first week of the tournament so <laughs> Yeah, actually, I would like to thank BJC and all the franchises. I mean, this pandemic, they were doing a tremendous job hosting the IPL and within India. Uh, and uh, unlike uh, all other T20 tournaments, IPL is really different with the quality of games being played in it. Uh, players from all around the world and quality players all around the world. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, okay. and uh, it's been a great first week uh, very tough call from the bcci because yeah indeed number of cases in india and they take this stand to run this tournament right now is what a brave move yeah, yeah they it was a stubborn decision to be honest but they got stuck to it and uh, hope hope it will continue without any disturbances in the world yeah. ipl is not uh, just a cricket tournament in india it's indian festival for the cricket lovers in india so everyone will be if also they can't lose on the money it's too much yeah. amount of money in yeah. the banks invested yeah exactly yeah. it's not even it's a full uh, room full of money yeah yeah <laughs> and <laughs> in each and every game you see a lot of money going here and there so, yeah number of sponsors maybe that's the reason for uh, connecting this within an year twice it was it never happened before two two seasons under an year Actually, yeah tough times but still they are doing it well so far yeah yeah even we must appreciate the franchises yeah. so they are taking a lot of care of the players yeah for the foreign players and all they have been doing very well yeah. and to convince the players to come to play in such conditions is really a great yeah south of country south of country for example they, they left the national team to play in the ipl same with us on the national team like we've seen west indies players doing the same since so many years yeah the teams and coming to play ipl and all the other leagues yeah and to be honest uh, south african players who came to ipl has costed the national team a series to pakistan oh yes they lost 3-1 i guess yeah t20 should have been a close contest if these players were available yeah. but yeah yeah 
they people mati out of the thing also be like they should also have, have a living right so that yeah. doesn't yeah. Have anything so they go where the money is okay. yeah money or anything yeah mm. exactly uh, so what so what, what was your favorite game uh what do you think was the favorite game in the first week of action would definitely be the mumbai indians pulling it back against the night riders uh, we can not yeah from the jaws of defeat they have been that they done they have done very well to pull it back and apart from that as we have done very well to so far i think KK yeah gave, gave it away easily that match yeah don't know what's going to the man dinesh karthik and russell played uh, different uh, from the natural game they want don't know whether they played any thing sorry they wanted to block the game instead of going for the shots yeah we all know how dangerous was russell was but the way he played that game was something you know which uh, could have just by any fan but we must have the bowlers number bowlers for pulling it back yeah, the bowl was very good yeah kk are almost needed 49 from 42 with seven wickets left in their hand and <laughs> morgan and then Okay, of Russell and Dinesh Dinesh Karthik. Yeah. But strange endings, and I think it followed with SRH in the next day. Yeah, okay. but is the problem with SRH every season is that they made order. The top three will do so them, but the middle order couldn't keep on the momentum going. Momentum going. Yeah. I think uh, also Manish Pandey. should look at his innings uh, yeah he should rather be go for the slog shots instead of uh, rather tucking and uh, looking around for singles yeah i think he's more happy with his 50 rather than the team winning not the fans and the team franchise <laughs> glad that he is scoring runs but uh, would be very happy that came in the winning cause yeah correct danish pandey He, he scored around 10 50s out of which eight of them were ended up in losses that would be and that that's the problem that would definitely be running on their minds now yeah no it would mm. he's he's in good form by the looks of it but uh, maybe he should concentrate more on finishing the games yeah is one of the main pillars of the SRH at the moment so he should rather take responsibility of finishing the games yeah middle order is also quite young so middle order was awful seriously awful but this is not this is not the first time it happened with the SRH it's over the seasons it's been the same story i don't know what they were going through when auctions were going on but there was no good player right like they couldn't yeah. find someone Of yeah indian like what do you say an indian player who can fit in the middle order slot yes i think they were ex- lot from vijay shankar but he couldn't uh, perform up to his expectations yes yes like always yeah shankar has put in so many different positions by yeah now as the rich however he couldn't uh, succeed in any role given to him yeah maybe it's tough for him as well because they expect lot from him yeah but uh, he couldn't even deliver as small yeah yeah correct hmm and and raju what's the first thing that comes to your mind when you hear the word rcb rcb oh my god yeah <laughs> <laughs> first match was a shock i mean yeah. it's obvious for mumbai but yeah. rcb did very well in that match too. yeah match also it was also a close game to be honest oh they were about to win and then they gave it away Vijay Shankar might have heard us. <laughs> Why? He got, he got he got rid of the dangerous Rohit Sharma. Yeah, Rohit is out. <laughs> yeah. Vijay Shankar performing finally. <laughs> yeah. Maybe he might have heard us. Yes. 
only does yeah, listen to us all the time. Yeah. <laughs> At least whenever we were talking about him in our WhatsApp conversations. Yeah. <laughs> the first thing what comes to my mind when I hear RCB is was their loyal fans and their top class memes. Yeah. Uh, their performance. Pretty good. Yeah. Not even they're excellent. <laughs> People were not rooting for them ever. Yeah. It happens even. But still the fans still stick, stick to them. Keep yeah. supporting them all the time. Yeah, yeah. It's more like uh, blind faith in the team. Yeah. Whatever happens, we will be with the team. It is the truth of the result. Yeah. Correct. And what's your call on teams chasing? Oh my god, chasing has been... I think uh, the teams have become very complacent. Maybe they are... thinking that it's too easy of a chase all the time yeah and then they are like they play well for the first 10 overs and then yeah. they think that it's too easy now so they'll go for their shots and eventually give it up so the whole match is gone so yeah i've seen three matches actually isn't yeah. it yeah where the team who was which which was almost winning lost the match exactly and yeah kkr SRH SRH and RCB match Yeah Also I thought uh, the Rajasthan and Delhi match would have been like that but yeah. thanks to Morris <laughs> the man 2 million dollar man doing what for his section cross Actually it was it was good 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 of Morris to finish yeah, actually that pre- that is what expected from him Yes like exactly. that and he's uh, anyway with the ball and uh, so what was your favorite uh, performance my favorite performance it will be of two hasel patel against mumbai indians and samson's brilliant 100 chasing 222 against the kings punjab and hasel patel hasel patel's final over against mumbai indians was terrific getting rid of the pandya yeah, but is not that easy and that to in that particular stage of the innings is really you know yeah actually mumbai have been struggling in their death overs in the batting yeah it looks so why is they've lost more than 5 wickets in the last 4 overs yeah three of them coming in the last yeah 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 first five wicket falls <laughs> against the indians yeah that, right yeah that to in 14 years <laughs> two right after the other now happened before and twice in a single uh, tournament yeah, that in one week <laughs> that's not uh, what yeah. really mom indians would take for yeah but uh, i think it doesn't matter when they are winning right? yeah true luckily they won the second match yeah. which they should have lost easily <laughs> to be honest <laughs> Chahar did a brilliant yeah. job to be honest Chahar did Deepak Chahar yeah no Rahul Chahar against KKR ah, Rahul Chahar yeah yeah four wickets yes. yeah he did and I uh, like bowls over last over bowl thanda I, I didn't expect bowl to be bowling in the first place because I thought they'll be giving to Marco Jansen yeah but then you know, trusted his experienced bowler and he delivered like, two wickets in the last over yeah that to one of uh, russell i guess yeah russell and pat comments comments yeah yeah that was good very good bowling yeah also i liked um, one innings of uh, nitish rana nitish rana was yeah, good in the first the very match. first match they played yes yeah he looked he looked in good touch i think it was against srh yeah it was against srh mm-hmm. it is and it was good uh, yeah Our three party as well yeah yeah they outscored uh, srh in the first match mm, yes even in that match srh has a uh, good chances of winning at the end but lack of middle order and uh, not fighting from pandey cost them the game 
Yeah. He's not yeah. even uh, finding the fence at uh, regular intervals. Yeah. Which he should be doing. Mm, I think so. Like, does having Kane in the team help? Help SRH? Or... It does really help, but whom do you left? Whom do you leave from the team? John Castro is very good. Warner, you can't be leaving Warner. And uh, that's pretty obvious with uh, Rashid as well. You have to choose between an all-rounder and a batsman. So, maybe if uh, one of war, war maybe you can go. Yeah. Nabi. Nabi should go. Nabi or Holder should go. Yeah. Hopefully, uh, the problem is because uh, Warner being the captain, being a foreigner. Yeah. Had there been an Indian player who has been the, who is the captain, they they could have at least swapped Warner with Williamson. The only chance SRH has to have a Indian player as captain is Bhuvanesh Kumar or Manish Pandey. with only with only two with only two srh players who are consistent yeah correct they don't even have a good middle order how can they come up with a new captain or else they should give to manish so that he'll play more responsibly yeah in the match Instead of i think he even uh, captain uh, karnataka I think he had a record last year. Yeah, he he even won it uh, for his team. Yeah, nine out of nine games or something. Like yeah. Tayyad Mustakali. Yes. Uh, I think it's good so far. Yeah. So, what do you think will the table be like? Next table B. <laughs> two on two. Who do you think? RCB and Sarraj. And rest all the teams yeah. with a loss and. Yeah. what team are you rooting for the next week? uh csk csk is that one team who doesn't expect a lot from them but they somehow manages to you know get over the line karan is a big advantage uh, first chennai sankaran yeah he can even bat and we saw it uh, pretty well He even finished when uh, Dathala got out. Yeah. Yeah. I think Dhoni didn't bat in both the matches, right? He got out for a duck in the first match. And uh, he didn't come to bat in the second. And the addition of Moin Ali will definitely benefit them. Yeah, Moin Ali was good. Yeah. Oh my god. Shankar is on a roll now. He got two. He must have definitely heard. And he's taking important wickets. That's what. And I think it's the commentator's <laughs> exactly. Someone just said he's batting on a different pitch, <laughs> and then the next ball he gets. It just happens every damn time. <laughs> But Surya Kumar Yadav is doing really good, like right from his inclusion to the Indian team. Yeah. Like he's doing nothing wrong. Yeah, he's just he's doing his job. He's just playing naturally. Yeah. yeah, he's doing it perfectly. Yeah, he's giving the best results for the team. True. Fielding or batting. And and even some of his shots were outrageous. Yeah, yeah. I think the one for against the uh, bat comments, I guess the full shot. Yeah. And even the very first ball he faced on his debut to Archer, that was some good stuff. Yeah. Interesting. We'll see how he yeah. goes about his career from now. Yeah. Okay, then uh, I think we are enough for now. Yeah, we are good. We'll come back again next week. Yeah. Yeah sure. So, thank you just yeah. Yeah. can't wait to talk more and more about this beautiful game that we were all in love with. Yeah. We should yeah. should talk. Yeah. Not just on what. <laughs> True. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Thanks, man. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. So guys um that was the first episode of the IPL 2021 edition uh, it is actually the first week round up wherein we i mean me and my friend Jashwant spoke about the performances from the first week of IPL 2021 so please uh, stay tuned for further episodes also if you have any suggestions or any um, comments about this episode please uh, write back to us so thank you for listening and hopefully we'll see you in the next week thanks Thank you.